Well, it's Friday. That's something to be excited about, right? And the snow's gone. Again. April showers, am I right? At least I looked outside today and that grass is a little greener. The greener, the better. I like green grass. What is up, everyone? We survived another week. Two weeks down. It's Friday again. And I'm alive. <laughs> it does feel good to make it. Even if it is just through the week. So what's everyone doing this weekend? Doing some things? I know I want to get out. Like to find an adventure. Gotta get my butt in the gym. And I also got a whole bunch of work to do. Gotta love that work. Oh yeah, baby. So this week's happenings. Finished up contract with a client. Had some snow. And SpaceX just launched their Falcon Heavy rocket yesterday. It was a success! It was really cool to see all three of the boosters landed. As well as there was a fairing recovery. I don't know what that means, Dan. So the fairing is what covers the payload at the top of the rocket. And basically they put these big nets on boats and then they caught them as they fell from space. Whoa, well that sounds kind of interesting. It is kind of badass and uh, it's the first time it's ever happened in history. They've had several attempts before, but this is the first they made it and it was on the first commercial launch of the Falcon Heavy. Oh yeah, the last one was just the demo. That's right. And actually last February, I was down there for that launch. It was pretty sweet to see. Feel the power! It is the world's most powerful rocket. So who else is ready to go to Mars? Maybe that's why I got my red shirt on today. <laughs> anyway, yesterday released the 21st Century Stoner music video for Awake. Woohoo! So if you haven't seen it already, be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Get it out to all your friends. Get me some views. And by doing so, make me smile. It's whatever. The key with everything is to not take it too seriously. It's true, because there's really so many things I wanted to do to that music video, but I really just decided, screw it. I don't, I don't care. <laughs> That's not totally true. I mean, I cared a little bit, but not enough to actually get the other shots that I wanted to get. So I actually just released it how it was three weeks ago. Why don't you just change it then? I wanted to. A lot of life happenings getting in the way, especially my best friend, depression. Came sneaking right in! Said you're not gonna be be. <laughs> My depression told me that I wasn't gonna be very productive for a little bit. <laughs> it always tells me that. And I say screw it! Yeah, you gotta do it anyway, right? To hell with depression! Put a smile on your face! Tell you what, seeing that snow on the ground was really kind of a bummer. But we're okay now. Life happenings. Stupid people. Plenty of assholes. Just takes all kinds and they're everywhere. They just suck the motivation and energy and inspiration out of you, man. Pfft. Get out of my way. And you get out of your own way. I... I know. I need to get out of my own way, too. Hell, I'm probably the main reason for all my problems. Oh, now there's a thought. Wouldn't it just be crazy if people realized that they were their own issue most of the time? They'd be like, damn it, Gary, you're always pissing me off. You know, I know it's not you. It's really just me, and I'm just venting it out right now, but you're just a really good friend. God damn it, Gary. It's not you at all. Who's Gary? Is that like the snail off SpongeBob? So do things without holding yourself back. What the hell are my vlogs even about anymore, man? Where's the focus? I thought this was an ADD generation. I think people are focused. <laughs> Other cool shit. So this super cool scientist chick crunched like five million terabytes worth of data and gave us a picture of a black hole. Ooh. So now we finally see what one looks like. It's black. It's a hole. <sighs> Let's talk about some VOD stuff. Video on demand. There's Netflix, Hulu, Prime, Showtime, HBO Now, Vudu, too many others to list. And now, Disney Plus. The Plus makes all the difference. I will have to say I'm actually kind of interested. Why? It's $6.99 and you're gonna get access to Pixar, Marvel, Star Wars, all the fun stuff, man. Not only that, the Star Wars movies as of recently pretty much have not been that good. They kinda suck. I thought they were pretty good. Really? Oh, Luke was drinking green milk out of a booby. For why? <laughs> I don't know why that's the first thing that my mind goes to, like how ridiculous that was. But what I'm trying to say is, John Favreau, the director of Iron Man, the guy who launched basically the whole Marvel Cinematic Universe, is directing a show called The Mandalorian. Ooh, what's that? Wait, is that Boba Fett? No, it's following another character that isn't either Jonah or Boba Fett. 
Is it Jonah? It's something that starts with a J, and then it was Boba. And they were the Fets. I don't really care, I just think the armor's badass. And it's gonna be a series. Ooh. So the Mandalorian's supposed to launch as soon as the platform launches, I think that's November 12th. They better give me at least a seven day trial. I'll binge that shit. Consume. I am a consumer. Proud consumer. I don't know. So what do you think about Disney Plus? It's gonna be cool. It's gonna be lame. Oh, the illusions. I mean, I think the answer is if you have kids, you're spending $7 a month. Woohoo! All the energy. Gone. I'm tired again. Ready for a nap. But you can't. You gotta go do things and work and stuff. Get out and do it. I will. Till next time. Peace. I'm out of here.